Hi guys, I'm going to show you how to send a video in Google Drive. You want to send a video in Google Drive and you're trying to figure it out. Well, we're going to show you here how you can do that. Now, now we are logged into our Google Drive folder and this is the video here that we want to send. It's called Winter Trees. And so it's very simple. If you want to send the video, what you want to do is click the three dots that you could see here that says more actions. The more actions, three dots is what we call them. Now scroll all the way down and see where it says share. Well, you want to click that. Once you click share, you have access to be able to add people that you want to share your video with. And in this instance, we're going to do info at BizCrown right there as you can see. And now what's going on here is if we click share or if we click send, this person's going to get the video. Um, but what we want to do is make sure that we are providing the right access and sending the right message, right? So that they know exactly what to do with the video and what they can do is what I would like to say with the video. So take note, this is very, very important. Okay. Now in this instance, Info at bizcronm.com, right? They are an editor. As you can see, this is very important. They're an editor. So they can edit, you know, change the name and whatnot. Now, if you don't want that to happen and you just want them to be able to comment on the video, there you go. You would choose commenter, right? Now, if you don't want them to be able to do anything, you would choose viewer. You just want them to be able to look at it. But as you can see, for default, it has uh, picked an editor. And you can also add expiration, which is pretty, pretty cool. Okay, so now this person's an editor and all you have to do now is just click check out, right? So here we go. And as we see, we are just gonna click send. Now when we click send, it's right here, it says um, share with a question mark. It's just making sure that we are sharing this folder with the right person, right? So info at bizcrownm.com is external to bizcrown media who owns the item. This organization encourages, encourages caution when sharing externally. Well, we want to share it anyway. So we click share anyway. And now this person will get an email with the right access to be able to view the video. And that's how you can easily, easily send a video in Google Drive to somebody. Now, another way to do it is simply to go to share right here and just copy the link. And as you can see at the bottom here, it says link copied, manage access, right? So when it says link copied, manage access, it's telling you that that, that link has been copied. Now you can simply go to your email, or go to a text message, paste that link there, right? This, this will be the link right here. You see, that's the link right there, see? So you'd paste the link right there uh, in your email or in a text message, and that person will then be able to access it, provided it's an open link. When I say open link, that's a link that's open to everybody, pretty much on the web that can view it. Now, if they can't for any reason uh, access that because you've made it a restricted file in this instance, what you would then have to do is grant them access via email. So what happens is they will receive you when they click that video, you will receive a notice that says, hey, this person is trying to access this video. Do you want to grant, grant them the permission? And in that instance, you would say, yes, grant this person this permission, and then they'll be able to access it. But those are the two ways you can simply, through more actions here, send a video to whoever you want to, whether via email, you could share it, or you can copy the link and then paste in your email or also a text message. I hope this was helpful. If it is, like the video, subscribe to our channel so you can continue to see content that's very helpful to you. Till next time. Take care.